with peacemaker John Cena. All right, so you are the number one grantor of Make-A-Wish, 650 wishes you have granted. Thank you. When you have that kind of openness and relationship and sort of open-heartedness towards kids, you know, I've read that you've said, maybe not, I'm in my career, I, I wanna be present for kids, now you're married, maybe, you know, I'm opening up more to the idea. Um, where are you at now? Because I think you would make like, kind of the world's greatest father. That's a, uh, you know, that, first of all, thank you for the comment. And uh, I really enjoy my life. Uh, I, I have been riding um, a lightning bolt for quite some time now. and. I've been given opportunities to do and see things that, man, I, I didn't even dream of. And I had some pretty lofty dreams. Um, it's, it's hard work. Uh, it's hard work to balance the time I need to run myself correctly. It's a hard work to be uh, the best partner and husband I can be to my loving wife. Um, it's hard to keep connections with those in my life that I love. Mm -hmm. uh, and it's also hard to, to put in an honest day's work. Um, just... I, this is just my perspective, again, totally not qualified, but I think just because you might be good at something is, for me, is not a strong enough reason to do that. Mm -hmm. You have to have passion for it. You have to have a fuel for it. It's like saying to somebody, man, you, you know, you're, you're pretty good with your hands. You'd be a great carpenter. Right. But if I want to be an actor, I'll be an actor. And, and just to say to somebody, you have a, a great interaction with young people, that's, that's flattering. I, I still am flipped. Uh, and the reason I love Make-A-Wish so much is because those aren't like, those are those families' wishes. It's like, yo, you can do anything you want. And Make-A-Wish's list is enormous. They literally will do anything you want. I want to kick it with John Cena and go see him wrestle. That is the coolest thing I have ever heard in my life. Because it, it means a lot of things. It means, one, something I'm passionate about affects people. It means, two, I can be a vehicle uh, to, to, to help make a wish come true. And it means, three, when we engage, when the wish actually happens. It's something that someone wants, and, and we're the finish line, and the joy on their face. And these are, these are uh, individuals who are tougher than I could ever imagine that are going through a set of circumstances that I just, I can't believe. And they get to just leave all that stuff at the door. Mm -hmm. And they get to relax and escape for a little bit and hang out and we get to talk. I've gotten uh, strategy, uh, strategy tips. Uh, I should do secret moves. Uh, I've been able to single people out in the crowd. I've been able to bring people in the ring. I've been able to uh, encourage people to create their own wrestling characters. Um, I've, I've met uh, Make-A-Wish families multiple times and seen the, the, the positive development that just our interactions had. Uh, I've, I've received unbelievably emotional, emotionally moving letters from parents um, after some, some very tragic circumstances happened about what the moment meant to them and will always mean to them. Um, Make-A-Wish is, is fantastic, but all those things considered, um, I, I love that. I love that joy. I love that connection. And, the, and, and that, that, that's where I'm at right now. And it, it, it is difficult water to tread because that, you know, everybody's like, well, when? I, I just know not now. You right. Know? I mean, I, your insights into people, kids, you're so right. Do you think you have any insight into why you have so much self-awareness? Well, uh... I, I've been uh, if honest enough to lean into my failures. I think a lot of times when we get knocked down, it's uh, real easy for us to do this. And um, when you stop and you do this, and that's the only person to blame, through hardship, um, through loss, through failure, through embarrassment, um, when you're the problem, you gotta lean into it and you gotta solve it. And, uh, in, in solving some pretty, um, some pretty difficult problems, you really gotta look at yourself. 
And, and for me, the, the stripping it down to the core was when I'm able to look at that guy and be like, I'm enough. If we have a conversation and you walk away being like, I don't like him, I, I still feel as if I'll project my full and authentic self to you. And if you don't like me, I'm sorry. And that's, that's the way it is. I just applaud you for talking about the failures because it's, um, I think that's very real. And again, very important for people to hear. It's so relatable. Yeah. It's not all, it's like, yeah, I've had failures, I've changed, I've looked at myself, I've conquered, I know where I'm at in life. I wanna help others, I'm not a professional. I, <laughs> like everything about you is really remarkable. I, I, I've always been your biggest fan, but it is really incredible to sit down and sense what kind of a true human being you are with no veneer and amazing proximity. Well, I mean. Except for the suit. So no veneer except for this giant veneer you have on. Uh, and uh, likewise, um, these are usually like four minute things where you got six questions to answer and it goes by format and it goes by real quick. Uh, I don't even know what you're going to use of this because you have to make your timeline on the show and I don't care because I'm having a great time sitting with you, talking and connecting with somebody I admire in front of a group of strangers that are bold enough to be here today. Even if there's one conversation that doesn't leave this room because they're going to edit all this down, uh, uh, you know, maybe a, a mother and daughter can take away a nugget and further their relationship or maybe somebody in the audience uh, can get something or a cameraman or, or somebody in the soundboard uh, booth. You know, maybe, maybe we can uh, help tip the balance a little bit. As someone who has been cut down to four and six minutes, a lot of my life in these forums, I'm out to break the rules. <laughs> so well, I think- I, I appreciate it, I appreciate it.